Hello, good morning. We would like to explain our project about um, science, mathematics, digital competences. It will present this project in the Science on Stage event. Our project is about the radio, radio connected station Torrevisens. It was developed for our students of Fort Ofeso, as Jan Accensi, and it was collaborated by the teachers Esther Pinto and Mark Badli. The radio connected television station make a research of different elements related with satellites, waves, and radio waves. And that's why we divide the project in these main aspects. First of all, we will explain the different orbits that orbit around the Earth, Leo, Meo, Geo, and then we try to, uh, to track the radio waves that are emitted along the Earth by different satellites. And in that way, we will make different challenges that will be developed for our students. As Mark said, there are three kinds of orbits. The Leo one, which is the low Earth orbit, the medium, the male, which is the medium Earth orbit, and finally the geosynchro orbit, which is the farthest, the farthest from the Earth. Leo satellites orbit around the Earth between 200 and 2,000 kilometers. They are used to, to take photos from the Earth. They um, also make some weather forecasts and observations. They are moving, rotate around the Earth in, two, in 19 minutes. And only 5% of them are in function. The rest of them are composed, are made, this space junk. The ISS, the International Space Station, it's one of the main uh, satellites that we can find in the LEO orbit. It moves uh, at 360 kilometers far from the Earth, and six space agencies take part of this project. One of them are the NASA, is the NASA, and another one is the ESA, two of the most important ones. Further away from LEO satellites, we locate MEO and GEO satellites. GPS, are one of the most important MEO satellites and for example geo satellites are used to um, analyze the weather forecast, the TV connections and also other online connections. Are very expensive in order to make this kind of elements and connections. <laughs> Leaving far the introduction of orbit part uh, away, we're gonna talk now from uh, the real project which is the radio connected station. Um, as you can see, it's composed by two parts, uh, the one which is a receiver, in this case the RTL2832U, which is a model capable of hearing from 50 MHz until 1.7 GHz, and then the other main part is the aerial, um, which you can buy a, a one already built, but some cases, in some cases you have to build your own one for wished frequencies. During the experiment, we can listen LEO satellites. Using different programs, can predict the tracking of them and um, using our aerial and receivers that are prepared for that. As Mark said before, we can listen LEO satellites um, like Radio Ham satellites or CubeSat satellites, which are mainly designed by technical universities. Um, the communication system um, we can use in order to listen this kind of, of signals are from one part sound in terms of FM and IM and walkie-talkie and the other uh, method communication in this, in this term image we could use SSTV which is a slow, can, slow scan television. In order to improve our radio connected station sometimes we can build or we must build our own uh, aerial. In this, kind, uh, in this uh, case, we are using a uh, 143.05 MHz antenna because it's the one which we would like to hear. We, we would like to hear. Um, this antenna is called a J radial and it's composed by a resistance wire of 300 ohms and also with an aerial wire cable which is capable of transmitting data. The first workshop that we propose is to locate different radio stations. They should be located in the frequency between 80 MHz to 110 MHz. The second workshop that we propose is to in locate the International Space Station using a website to go and predict where it is located and determine where and when 
is the station. To conclude, we just have to say that with a low budget and a low cost uh, materials, we could do a really interesting uh, investigation about space. Thank you very much.